A very, very warm welcome to the Royal Institution and a very warm welcome to the very first Be Talent breakfast meeting. It's a real pleasure to have so many of you here. I don't think I'm here to convince you to take a strengths approach or that strengths should be part of the way in which you assess, develop and retain talent. But actually, my question is, how can we continue to use strengths in this VUCA world, in this volatile, unpredictable, complex and ambiguous world in which we work? The pace, the demands of the world has changed, actually. So how can we possibly identify our strengths and use our strengths to the best of our ability when actually the day sometimes just gets in the way. We started to um, recognise the strengths in one another and what we were, um, each of us were bringing to that group. And that ultimately just meant that we were far more effective. But it changed the nature of the conversation. We looked at one another very differently. It built respect, it built understanding. Most athletes, especially Olympic athletes, are very, very motivated and brought alive by the Olympics. So. When I look back at my career having retired and I look back at what I did in order to become an Olympic medalist, I think it's absolutely bonkers now. When I look at it, um, training six hours a day, 49 weeks a year, but you're so um, energised by that goal of winning an Olympic medal that the hard work and the you know, blood, sweat and tears just isn't really a, a problem at all.